What's going on, everybody? You get the raging Rob here. I'm just, uh, I'm in Chats. I'm in Chiefs Land, Florida. Chiefs Land, Florida. That's where I'm at. It's, uh, off the, uh, U.S. Highway 19. It's off the freeway. I just came out of Tallahassee not too long ago. On my way to Clearwater. Got my coffee. Got my Dunkin' Donuts coffee. I was in the mood for some donuts. I don't know why. I have a crave for fucking donuts. So. Anyway, I got breaking fucking news. Conservative talk show host Rush Limbaugh. Great guy. He just got a presidential freedom award or something from President Trump. Well, he passed away today at the age of 70. Battled with lung cancer. Very sad day for conservatism. This guy was on air for 33 years. Over 600 radio stations broadcast him. 33 years is a long time, man. You know, I remember, I remember uh, when, I, when I lived in Phoenix... I was a nighttime cab driver for a few years, and I picked up this one guy, and he was getting very political on my car. Almost wanted to smack him. This was like 2011. He had to be a liberal. Now, at that time, in 2011, I was like, I wouldn't say liberal, I wouldn't say conservative, but I was like, I just did, I just didn't, I don't know what I was. I mean, I voted for Obama in a way. But I just kind of... I didn't get really into politics until later that year. But anyway. So I had this guy in the back of my cab. 2011, Phoenix, Arizona. And he just kept going political. And he get, then he says... You know what? One day I was in the back of a cab. One day I took a cab. I'm like, yeah. And he's like, that fucking cab driver, he had Rush Limbaugh on the radio. You believe that shit? Rush fucking Limbaugh. He had Rush Limbaugh on the fucking radio. I'm like, dude, I was about ready to jump out that fucking cab. I'm like, dude, okay, she can shut up now. So that's one story I remember about Rush Limbaugh. Anyway, sad day for conservative conservatism today. You know, I'm I kind of go down the middle. I try to go down the middle as best I can. Yeah, I am conservative, but I try to go down the middle. I'm more of a centrist, but I try to go down the middle. I try to see both sides point of view. Try my best. Liberalism is a fucking disease. I'm going to say that right now. I would not consider myself alternate right. For the simple fact. If that pickup truck comes back around, I'm going to get a picture of his flag. There's a, there's a pickup truck that keeps driving down. He's got a Trump flag in the back of his pickup truck. Trump is my president, not Joe Biden. Joe Biden will never be my president. But anyway. What was I saying? I fucking forgot now. I try to see both points of view. I'm not, I'm not alternate right for a simple fact, you know. The alternate radical right is like the KKK and the and the 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 uh the Aryan Brotherhood and shit like that. I don't I don't do that. I mean I support the militia. You damn right I do. Because it's in the Constitution, a well regulated militia. But anyway, Rush Limbaugh. Who's that guy with that fucking flag? He was going up and down the street here.
You know, we keep losing conservatives. Liberals are going to take over. I had a conservative die today. We need a liberal talk show host that needs to die. How about that? I know, I should, that's not very Christian-like of me. I shouldn't say that. I'm sorry, Lord, forgive me. But I'm not of the alternate right. Absolutely not. I try to... You know, I'm not some of these people that... I'm not one of these guys that sees a Black Lives Matter protest happening and, and beats and be, beats people up. You know, I try to go over there and talk to them. You know? That's what happened in Shelby Township. I try to go over there and talk to them and they just... They try to beat me up. You know? It's like, what the fuck? Anyway... Rest in peace, Russell Limbaugh.